So now I'm going to demonstrate how we can use the alternate color styles that are defined directly inside site styles. Okay. Remember inside site styles in the text colors, we have our normal kind of default colors for various text components, but we also have alternate colors. How can we use these alternate colors? Now, if we look at my page, you'll notice that I have some uh, content. Now, a lot of times a strategy that we, we will have inside of our websites is we'll have kind of bands. We'll have maybe a section of our, our pages that are light colored, and then we will have different parts of our section that are dark colored. A lot of times on those darker sections, we want to have different color text, right? So let's say, for example, uh, I wanted to use the alternate color scheme in this container. Really simple. If I want to apply the alternate colors to everything that's within this container, all I need to do is click on this container, go to the custom classes and type the word alt, A-L-T. And what you'll notice is once I apply this alt class to the container, all the text within it became white. It used our alternate colors. Now the text became white because inside of site styles, we defined our alternate colors as being light colors. So white or shades of white. And our links are still blue. Now what you'll notice when we preview this page is, it's not really useful having um, you know, white text on a white background. So let's quickly show you how you can um, add on top of the alternate styles. So if we add a background swatch, Let's go ahead and do a background. Let's change the class to be alt because we want to apply um, this background to everything that has the alt class. I'm going to simply go to background and let's choose a darker color. There we go. Now, if we scroll down, what well, you'll notice directly inside edit mode, that style has already been applied. Again, it's really simple to add the alternate class. If I just delete that, you'll notice that it reverts to the default styles. All I need to do is add that alt class and I get all of the benefits of using the alternate colors that are defined directly inside site styles. Now, if you're familiar with swatches, you probably are aware that the alternate colors that are within site styles is essentially the same exact thing as if I were to add a text color swatch and then create the class for alt, right? It's the same exact thing. It's just kind of a nicety to have it baked into site styles for us.